for that. Okay, so we're going to do a, uh, a video on the piano chords. The piano chords paper I should be giving you, and we're going to do the first column on the piano chords, just straight down. So it's A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and then we do the flats. So uh, I'm going to break down each one of these chords so it's a little easier for you to practice today. So what's the first chord is A. Focus on my hand from here. A chord is going to be A, C sharp, E. Play all those notes together, there's your A chord. The next one is B. B major is B, D sharp, F sharp. Can you play those all together? C is an easy one. C, E, G. D is D, F sharp, A. Play those all together. E is just like that. We just go up a note. E, G sharp, B. F is all white keys. F, A, C. And G is all white keys to G, B, D. That would be the first part of the, uh, the practice session I would do. The next ones you could do uh, in a minute. But try to put those with some sort of patterns. Yeah, well, everybody else on YouTube, too. So we're going to try to do those, but we're not just going to play them like whenever we feel like it. We're going to try to make music out of this. So watch how I do this. A. sound like a song, but it's at least you're kind of playing like music. Um, <coughs> the next part is the flats. We're going to put our thumb on a flat for the next five chords. So the next one is A flat, C, and E flat. Some people use, uh, I've heard these called uh, Oreo chords, because white in the middle, black on the outsides, so you could use that to kind of help you remember them. The next one is B flat, and that's two white keys. The next one is another Oreo, black key, D flat, F, A flat. The next one's another Oreo, E flat, G, B flat. And the last one is all flats. Okay. So we're going to add that to the whole list. So we're going to start at A, we're going to keep going all the way down to G flat. Okay? The idea is to practice these a lot so you can get all the way through without really making a mistake. Let me show you how I do that. And watch how we could use those accompaniment patterns you've learned. Oh, A. A. So when you can do it just like I did it, all straight through all 12 of those chords, then you're done with it. Don't stop in the middle, and don't make it so you're taking two minutes to get to each chord. And, all right? So be able to do each chord fast and like music. That's it for me, YouTube. Goodbye. Wait, Hit the button. Wait, wait, wait. Do it fast. Hit the button. The red one? Yes.